challenge for two students to uh, class today on this Wednesday the 27th. I hope you guys are doing well today and I hope you're ready to um, learn some more math. We have a lot to do as usual. So let's jump right into this. Here we go. First of all, you'll have a test next week, hopefully, okay? Um, at this time, please turn your homework in from yesterday. Stop and make sure your name is on it, please. All right, turn your homework in now at this time. Incomplete. Um, uh, let's see, I did, this is Friday's homework, Michael and Libby. I have not gotten that from you. Monday's homework, Michael and Libby. I have not gotten that from you guys. Now, I will have your quizzes graded by tomorrow. I did not grade them yet, so I don't know who did not take it. If anyone did not take the quiz yesterday, they must take it by Friday. Okay, so make sure you understand that. Remember, if you're absent one day or many days, it doesn't matter. The first day you come back, if we're taking a test or a quiz, you will take it unless you contact me while you were absent. Okay, um, so please don't get behind on your videos. Today we'll be taking notes and working on homework. The video today is about finding the distance between two points and finding the geometric mean of two numbers. This is definitely review material, and I think your students will find it pretty easy for the most part. The teaching video is called Algebra 2 Lesson 7.5 Part 1. It's only about 15 minutes long. Now the homework is due tomorrow because if you'll look, the, the, the help video is only 20 minutes long. So I did that on purpose on a Wednesday so that you could finish your homework and turn it in. So really, you're going to turn this in today, and you're also going to turn this in today. All right? So there we go. Um, the homework is right here, page 378, these numbers here. And on number four, on number four, um, uh, when you read it, you'll see it says to, to find the distance between two points using the distance formula and Pythagorean's theorem. Ignore that. I just want you to find the distance for number four using Pythagorean's theorem. Do not use the distance formula on number four. Okay. All right, moving on. Now let's talk about your test for a second. First of all, students, there were four A's, two B's, one C, and one F. There were no D's. Second of all, each mistake is two and a half points off, so please check my work. Add up all of your mistakes. Multiply it by 2.5, and that should be how many points were taken off. Okay. Uh, highest grades in the class, Kobe had a 95. There were a couple of 93s, but Kobe had the highest grade in the class, so congratulations to her. Now, with it being Wednesday, I want all of your attention on this video and the homework, so your test correction video will be tomorrow. I'm warning you now, tomorrow will be a very busy, packed algebra class, so understand that, okay? All right, moving on. Um, one of you has asked about a retake. <clears throat> please email me with the day and the hour and the teacher that you're going to do that, please, okay? Try to give me at least one day notice so I can make the test. That's all for today, students. Please get started on your notes and homework. Have a great day. Contact me if you have any questions at all.